do. Here are some meditations with specific influence on the Vishuddhi Chakra. The first meditation we can do is to sit comfortably and erect, straight back, and relax your body. If you are unable to sit comfortably on the floor, then sit in a chair. Close your eyes. Feel yourself happy, relaxed, and free. Inhale and exhale deeply a few times. And through this, deepen the relaxation more and more. Do not concentrate. Remain without imagination. Be conscious only of yourself and say to yourself, I want to relax completely. Relax the jaw, the lips, eyelids, forehead and cheeks. Try to relax your face muscles completely. Relax the shoulders, arms and hands. Relax the back muscles, abdominal muscles, legs and feet. Relax the whole body from the toes to the head and from the head to the toes. Now direct your attention to the center of your chest, the Anahata Chakra, the heart. Remain completely relaxed. Analyze your thoughts without condemning anything. Be totally conscious of your thoughts. Observe the coming and going. Push nothing away and hold on to nothing. Relax the whole body. Relax. Relax. Now direct your consciousness to the process of breathing. Feel the breath flowing in and out. Allow your breath to flow freely. Now place the index and middle fingers of the right hand at the base of the throat between the collarbones. With this, do not exert any pressure. If the arm becomes tired, you can change hands. Relax the head and neck. Do not look upward behind your closed eyes. Rather, look slightly down, as if you are reading a book. Remain completely quiet, without expectations. Merely observe and let come what comes. Breathe a little deeper than normal and observe your breathing. Feel the warmth of your fingers and the whole body. Now immerse yourself in your inner space and visualize your present life up until now as if it were a film running. Be honest and follow mentally the course of events. Each image, each recollection should arouse exactly the same feeling as when you actually experienced the situation. This exercise arouses painful but also beautiful feelings within us. Allow it to be as it is and simply observe everything. Go as far back as you can remember. Generally, the negative experiences rise first into the consciousness. Continue on unwaveringly. Remember, feel and experience the pain disappointments and fears of that time again with full consciousness. 
from what have you suffered? Today, yesterday, the day before yesterday, last week, over the last month, you can either go backwards from the present time into the past or progress from your childhood up to the present day. Many insignificant events pass through the mind, but suddenly there is a point at which you falter. Stay there with full awareness and dive deeper. Experience the events again clearly. Feel that you are not alone. The divine and your spiritual teacher are there and hold your hand. Do not be afraid. You are protected and accompanied. Go deeply within and experience that which you have suffered, that from which you have suffered. After you have performed this exercise for about 15 minutes, place your hands on your knees, bend forward slightly, and press the chin against the sternum. This is called Jalandhara Bandha. Feel the breath flowing through your throat. Return your consciousness to the experience you have been dealing with. With the inhalation, imagine that you received that which you needed at that time. Air, comfort, help, love. With the exhalation, Release everything that caused you pain at that time. Exhale the dark and painful memories and inhale light, happiness and liberating feelings. Release the painful experiences because to give freedom means to attain freedom. Perform this exercise for about 15 minutes then slowly raise the head and remain sitting relaxed. Let the practice continue to have an effect and observe your inner world. Time has passed, but the feelings and injuries from earlier times are still always deep within you. Hold nothing back. Look within yourself without fear. Try to understand your life. Why was I born? What should I achieve in this life? What is my life's work, my dharma? Through concentration on the Vishuddhi Chakra, the answers to these questions open for you. That was the end of meditation one. Next time we'll read the next two meditations. May you have gotten anything from the description of these meditations. Namaste.